So let's make another quick unedited video. Somebody suggested putting a smoke detector to my Geiger counter with alpha sensitive tube with a micro window. So this is a smoke detector, a very old smoke detector made by Tesla. And it says some warning on it. 35 kilobecquerels. 35 kilobecquerels, it says. And it's very old. You can see some very old fashioned components, some metal transistors, some very old resistors, capacitors, and let's try to put it to my Geiger tube. And it's about 22, 23 millirangens per hour, but from just this distance, it's virtually nothing. So about two centimeters or three centimeters away, it's completely safe. Two centimeters, one centimeter, and close proximity. Basically, the alpha particles are stopped just by the air. And this smoke detector was donated to me, so thank you for your donation. And it's quite a dodgy device, but also not so dodgy because the radiation doesn't really reach very far. But of course you have to be careful not to rub this surface of the americium source because you don't want to spread the material from it. And here is my Nixie clock made of Soviet components. There are Soviet Nixies, but also Soviet chips. There are four Soviet chips. The camera probably doesn't focus on those. Or maybe it does. It's a phone, so it's quite rubbish. And it basically contains very similar chips as those Soviet clocks. Or also those Soviet clocks. Electronica. So it basically contains the same clock chips as those Soviet clocks, but one of them is a seven segment driver and this seven segment driver is replaced by a Nixie driver, which is basically a decoder like one out of ten. So this one is replaced by another chip and those two are the same as in the Soviet clocks and because this driver doesn't have a latch in it, like the seven segment display, uh, seven segment decoder does, I have added some external latch, a Soviet one, of course, as well. Here, here you can see, or you probably can't see because it doesn't focus, the other two chips. And I have already made a Nixie clock using vintage components made by Tesla in Czechoslovakia in probably 70s or 80s. So this is my Nixie clock made of Tesla components from Czechoslovakia. All components are basically vintage. A transformer, 7805, some capacitors, those chips and those Nixies. And now I'm building a clock out of Soviet components. Now it's just in a breadboard, but it may be in a box later. And my gas heater seems to work nicely. No explosion yet. And of course, because Christmas is coming, I have installed those fairy lights or Christmas lights. Very nice. Let's take a look at them. And of course they are tungsten lamps. No stupid LEDs. Those are vintage from about 70s or 80s. And I like the tungsten lamp light, which is very soft. In camera it actually looks quite blue, but in real life this one looks very washed out. And here you can see my cat's things. 
here is her home and here is a cat heater basically and the lamps are basically just in series running on main voltage all in series and the tungsten lamps are 24 volts 50 milliamps and the cable is kind of split so I can put my clamp meter on it and I can see that it's 47 milliamps and here you can kind of see the tungsten lamp in it but my phone doesn't really focus so much up, up close it's very nice and of course here's my cat which is curious